You know what? Let's give Vanguard Zombies another shot. And before you freak out, no, I'm not done playing Cold War. I'm still going to play that mainly, but we'll be playing a little Vanguard in addition to that. So I really feel like this last update was kind of heading in the right direction. And then seeing that they're delaying season two to work on it, to make it better. They're trying to make it more like older Zombies games. At least that's how they're making it seem like in uh, their update tweets. But you know, let's, let's just give it another shot and try to get our STG Gold Viper today. All right, so we used this a little bit last time around here to check out the update, but we didn't quite get everything done. So we need to get about uh, 3,000 eliminations. I forgot how many kills you need for this. And another 3,000 pack punch eliminations. We need to get 10 rapid kills 50 times. We're at seven. And we need to get about 1,000 more kills as a result of our covenant. Oh, wait, that's not it. We need 2,000 eliminations with seven attachments and four more Jackrabbit medals. So we got quite a bit of work to do today. And I've been having these COD points sitting on my account for a while. So I might as well just trade them in for the one of the only Mastercrafts in this game so far. So let's go ahead and equip that. Where do I do that at? Right. Nope. Let's go right here. Does the camo go over it? It does. Okay. So let's see if Pack-a-Punch works on it. So I'll leave it blank for now. And just in case you're curious, here are the attachments we're going to be using. I'm just going to keep it default to the Mastercraft besides the scope. And we're going to be using Ring of Fire today. So let's go ahead, hop in and try to get this thing done. All right, we're in game. There still is no pause. So I'm going to try to find if they added an inspect button. People were telling me they did last time. Oh, that's controller. It says there is weapon inspect, but it will not let me inspect it. So let's do the quick little shoot. Ooh, that looks kind of cool. The reload. Okay. At least the gun looks nice. But yeah, I feel like Vanguard's trending kind of in the right direction. On uh, the last update, it added a round-based type thing. I feel like that's kind of a little bit just to hold us over until they can get in everything that they want. Oh, really quick. Let me hop into an event. I'm going to hop into Blitz. But it seems like in their last update, they're talking about how they want to move more towards a classic zombies feel and how they're going to be adding a lot more to it and how it wasn't ready for the season two update. So they pushed it back. So I feel like that's a good thing. Uh, hopefully they do add a bit more to this make it you know play more like older zombies games you know get us back into that gameplay loop but i do like some of the things this game has already added like i think covenants are pretty fun uh the perk system is interesting i would have liked rather to have like a crystal system like in cold war i liked being able to play and then like slowly upgrade things over time like a roguelike type game. But I guess I could see past that for just perks and everything like that if we had some like nice round based maps or if they decided to bring back some older ones like Shino Numa, if they were to open up the whole thing, I think that'd be a lot more fun. But I, I guess time will tell and we'll we'll see where this game goes. Because I, I think I've said this in every single Vanguard Zombies video I've done and I'll continue to say it. I love the aesthetic of it. The lighting and everything in this engine is so like perfect and beautiful that it, it's a shame that this game isn't as good as it could be because even the movement and everything in this it just feels so smooth like i can feel like i control anywhere i go like effortlessly like there's no kinks in the engine of like how i'm moving so i guess what i'm trying to say is i hope that the updates coming here in the future help this game out because i i want to see it succeed it's just kind of tough to play sometimes i guess i'm just going to try to open the map real quick until we can get all the way up there uh, i want to be able to have access to all the perks so when i have enough money i can just head back buy all the perks and then go right back to shino numa to grind but i think i've taken out all the storm creakers and all the boom shriekers and we really just need to work on our rapid kills and i think once we're in shino numa that should be a little easier like we won't even have to think about it and then we really just need to get this thing pack a bunch and start working on those kills too i'm glad crits aren't really a factor but doubling the amount of kills you need is a little overkill i mean quite literally like in every sense of that word but I i'm glad i haven't done too many weapons for zombies i think i've only done like four or five maybe of getting like the full gold viper so that like if there is a nice big update of them adding a lot of content to zombies then i'll still have plenty of weapons to grind on the way but if not then this will just be stuff that i can do for uh for streams also i want to go ahead and apologize for not uploading or streaming as regularly as i used to uh, it's honestly been a combination of a few factors one my my mine and my girlfriend's anniversary is coming up here pretty soon so i've been doing some stuff to prepare for that uh also my birthday is just a few days after that as well oh monsoon camo let's go but you know besides that like that shouldn't really hold me back not not that I'm letting it, but uh, my sleep schedule has been absolutely awful. I've been, you know, some of you guys know I do still work a, a second job while I'm doing this, but I, I work 
night. So I'm working like 11 p.m. to 7 a.m., which is already like a kind of rough sleep schedule, but I've been making it work. But then I've just been staying up the extra like four hours after I'm I'm done with work. Like I, I my sleep schedule has been awful. My time management has been awful. So it's all completely on me and I, I, I'm working to get that improved. I'm working on uh, changing my sleep schedule. So hopefully we'll have more videos and more streams for you guys soon. I've just been uh, delinquent. We just picked up Diabolical. We already have four perks, which is pretty good. I mean, none of them are upgraded, but just having them being able to be accessed is nice. Ooh, and I forget this thing has a bayonet. So we can just start picking up some melee kills with this. Let's do a bayonet charge. Wait, why, why did it stop? Oh, <laughs> bayonets are fun. We almost have enough to get Pack-a-Punch, so I'm trying to just get a few more kills here. We probably should have changed out the mag because 20 bullets does not seem like a whole lot here. Oh, let's check on our Covenants too. Deadshot? I don't know if we want that, but Brimstone I think would be fun to try out, so let's do that. Oh, uh, we're only 200 points away from getting this thing Pack-a-Punch. Is there any more zombies on the map? Or do I take them all out? Oh, wait, here's a few. Oh, I can see Brimstone hitting them. Like, if you look at their chests, ooh, start to take a little damage just from being near me. That's kind of sick. I like that. See, the Covenants make... make it so you can have a, a lot more fun things like this but we did just get enough to go ahead and get pack a punch so let's throw that on here hopefully pack punch camo actually goes on and it doesn't look like it does let's take a quick look oh i accidentally threw a nade instead of reloaded let's try to get in the light here does it look like there's a camo on there i don't think so i don't know maybe i'm blind and it could just be subtly on there but i'm not seeing it but we still have one more covenant thing or heart whatever they're called but we're gonna upgrade our ring of fire and hop on into this transmit round oh and also with microsoft you know acquiring activision blizzard i i feel like maybe they might put a little more love into vanguard maybe they're gonna shift some resources into it but that might be wishful thinking i haven't seen anything you know to uh, back that up i'm just trying to be hopeful about the game because you know there is a lot of hate for vanguard but i want to see it succeed you know i want to see it do well oh shit back up Oh, let's go. Is that 10 rapid kills? It better be. Let's go. And it's complete. On to the next one. Oh, we got a camo to end it. Sick. All right, let me in. Thank you. Oh, wait. First, before that, what covenants you got for me? Deadshot, Shatterfest, and Brain Rot. I don't want that. So I guess if I don't see a covenant that I like or that can help us grind camos, I'm just going to upgrade her in a ring of fire. And we can finally get quick revive. Grab it, please. Thank you. All right, let's hop in the harvest round. All right, let's get the runes and get this done. Zombies spawn now. Let's see if I can get 10 of these zombies to spawn and see if I can get some rapid kills. But I'm pretty sure there's like a cap of like five or six for these early harvest rounds. Yeah, this looks like all of them. That's a shame. Oh, there's Lambit. We're all done with our normal camos or our normal kills. All right, I'm getting a little too ahead of myself. Let's throw these in here. I'm trying to like grind in here. But right now we're setting up before we grind. Deposit these under the last one. Ooh, these 10 kills rapidly might start getting tough with this low mag that I have. Even while it's pack punch, that has 35 bullets, but that still doesn't seem like a whole lot. Ooh, armor and double points. Maybe I'll farm some points here before I end this. Oh yeah. I definitely wish I came into this with a, a larger mag. I'm having to reload every five seconds. We're gonna have to upgrade speed cola. Ooh, we just got a calling card. Let's go. We're definitely gonna need some covenants that put ammo back in our mag. I think that's the only way we're getting around this without backing out and putting in a different mag. All right, let's just get a few more kills here. We'll get up to 10k and then we'll go ahead and exit this. Oh, insta kill. That helps. Oh, another camo too. Don't know what it was for, but we got one. Oh, jackrabbit. So we're done with our jackrabbits then. There's a carnage metal. Insta kill helps out with that. Honestly, brimstone and insta kill is kind of crazy. Zombies just don't get near you. You start racking up kills for nothing. This is ridiculous. It actually can't touch me when there's an insta kill. Oh, and we got some pack a punch camos going in too. Like to see it. All right, we're at 10k. I, I can't sit here and slam these zombies. I mean, I very well could, but I want to go do it in round base. All right, let's pick up all the stuff they left behind here, which is not much. Oh, we're so close to getting packed too. I'll have to kill a few zombies when we get back to the hub. All right, let's see what we got here. Anything to help? Epic gain much more salvage from pickup. Oh, it's scrap where I was reading the tier. Uh, shh. Splatter fest in Call of the Week. I don't really want any of those. So I'm going to upgrade Ring of Fire again. Where you at, zombies? I'm going to need a little cash from you. A quick little loan. Honestly, even getting something to help with like melee kills would be sick. So we can just put this bayonet to use. But we got enough now. Let's go ahead and get this pack too. Maybe that camo will stick on here, but we'll see. Throwing it on. Okay, obviously it replaces the weapon, but no visual difference. That's a shame. It'd be cool to see pack punch camos on this because I really like the pack punch camos in this game. Let's do our transmit event, and then we'll go ahead and open up the final way over here to Shinonuma. Oh, and we get to Shinonuma anyways. All right, come on. Let's move floating head. Let's get a move on. I still don't understand why I have to like give this had a, a escort like the zombies obviously don't care about it why don't you just fly to where it's going and it's usually like right around the corner from where it needs to be 
like at the start. Like you ain't far from where you're trying to go. Why you need help? If anything, I need your help. Why can't I levitate? And we're done. Sick. Is there pack a bunch over here still? No, there's not. Only in round based version of this. All right, this way is opened up now. Let's check our covenants. Please be something that can help. Death blow and ammo gremlin. The upgraded version of ammo gremlin is real good, but right now I think death blow probably helps the most. And with our cash right now, I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade jug and also repair our armor or get armor level two. That helps. Come here, Jug. We'll grab it twice. Never mind, I'm broke. And we have a MGK shooting at us. Please die. I'm gonna bayonet you. Never mind, you're too big. Uh-oh. Insta-kill. We like to see. Let Brimstone do all the work. We're literally invincible during insta-kill with Brimstone. Dead. Sleep. Look, I can just kill him by looking at him. Go on. Oh, wait. Did you want to die too? Sleep. Go to bed. What's up, fellas? Dead. <laughs> I'm literally getting a slaughter medal by not doing anything. All right. Time for a blitz. All right, now we just gotta survive here for three minutes. And then we got nothing else to do than go on Shinonuma. Oh, actually, maybe our mag count won't matter as much when we start using Ring of Fire. I just always forget to use it, at least in this game. Because Ring of Fire has not been good until recently. And you're not really staying in like one spot when you're doing all these other objectives, especially things like transport, where you literally can't just stay in one spot. But once we get all set up on Shino, we should be kind of just tearing through these zombies. Ooh. And we're getting our seven attachments camo and I think a pack a bunch camo. Let's go. Double camos. Like to see it. Ooh, nice max ammo. This feels like such a long blitz event. Honestly, you kind of get lost in the sauce a little bit. All right, MGK. Why don't you settle down there, bud? I'm still getting like no carnage medals. Hopefully that changes in Shino. I think it will. I think we'll be fine. We finally finished it. Let's go. Look at this dude. Sleep. All right, Covenants, what you got for me? Deadwire Legendary. Mm. Chance to stun normal or special enemy when shooting it may also stun nearby enemies. I don't really want that. I want to get that ammo gremlin one, but I guess we'll get Ring of Fire tier five, which is perfect because now we're going to head on into the void, which is Shino. Actually, let's upgrade some perks first. I want to get Jug up one more tier and then with the rest of the money, I think I'm going to upgrade uh, Deadshot. Let's grab this. Zombies, please get out of the way. I need to buy a perk, please. Stop spawning. Okay, let's snag it. We still have 6,000, so I'm gonna go upgrade uh, speed coal a little bit too. All right, here we go. We still have enough to upgrade something else? Nope, it's 5,000. We can upgrade again when we come back. Oh shit, that zombie actually scared me bad. Ooh, get off the stairs. Get out of my way. All right, let's head to Shino. All right, this is where the fun begins. We have our magic piece of paper in the air. Our nice little legs holding it together. But I think the best place to go right now is right down here in this corner. There's gonna be no spawns over to our right. Everyone's gonna be coming down the stairs into our left. Oh, so let's ring a fire. Our fully tiered up ring of fire. Fuck up the storm Krieger. And also this ring of fire has been busted. I, I, I've been hearing it's real easy to, to get to round 100 and I've seen some clips of just ring of fire insta killing everything. I don't know if that's happening now. Maybe they nerfed it. But right here in this spot just spamming ring of fire has looked kind of crazy but i'm glad there's at least one spot on here where you can grind camos at and it's not all just like claustrophobic training in here and if we get hungry we got some uh oh never mind they're gone i know what they were anyways i can hear an mgk stomping around why don't you go ahead and show your face so oh, there he is get away from me oh yeah that ring of fire is definitely gonna come in clutch i am running out of ammo so fast 35 bullets is definitely not enough if you're wondering oh ring of fire is ready let's go i don't know if we're getting any kills as a result of our covenant though we might have to Go back and pick a different covenant. Oh, get out of here, Storm Krieger. Do not need any of that. You just wait till I get this Ring of Fire, pal. All right. I guess we will escape here with a heart, hopefully. And then we can get a covenant that can actually help us with our camo challenges. How do I level up my three-line rifle? What? I'm not even using a three-line rifle. Oh, yeah. I forgot about this. Me when the sativa hit. All right. Please, covenant. Give me something good. Death Blow. Legendary. We like that. But there's also Dead Accurate. Oh, I really want Legendary Death Blow. But I think Dead Accurate is actually going to help us with the camos. Yeah. So let's do that. And we can't fully upgrade any thing but we have some money for perk let's get jug as max as we can let me get dead shot leveled up as well oh, on, one more one more there we go and we don't have enough to upgrade anything else i just want to be able to do as much damage as possible and it looks like we can we can also tank a, a lot of damage too can we upgrade this at all does this even help maybe yeah let's just do it why not health regen speed could be good let's just take out this guy before we go ahead in Oh, what'd you drop? What's this? A bar. Don't need it, but I appreciate the offer. Let's head on back to Shino. All right, back down. Where's our hole? Where, where's our, our camping spot? Found it. Oh, and we already have a ring of fire. Let's go. Get bent, MGK. Still not getting our rapid kills, though. Come on, where's our carnage medals at? We have to go back to the old-fashioned way, because I'm only getting slaughter medals. Oh, wait. No, we got an insta-kill. 
Oh, uh, right when the round ends. Come on. Start up the next round fast. Any day now. There we go. And it's over. What a waste of an insta kill. Oh, there's another uh, camo for seven attachments. Don't know if our, our covenant one's working though. Bring a fire ready. Pop it. Very low health. Extremely low health. The storm creaker's got to go. Come on. Die. Thank you. And thank you for the armor. Oh, double points. Definitely need that. Actually, does double points even work in here? My points don't move. What is the point? What is the double point? Oh, and we just did get a covenant camo. Perfect. So now we know for sure it's working. This Mastercraft's kind of booty. I feel like I'm not doing any damage. Maybe it's because the round's getting a lot higher. We don't have pack three. Get the fuck off me, zombies. Thank you. Thanks for understanding. What'd you drop for me? A Sten? I think I already have that done. All right. I'm going to escape again. I'm going to go check on the covenants and then come right back. All right. What do you got for me? Ammo gremlin. Perfect. This is what we need instead of death blow. Perfect. So brimstone, dead accurate, and ammo gremlin. What a combo. Let's see if we can finally upgrade our armor to level three. We can. And I think I'm going to save the rest of my money. I could upgrade some perks. You know what? Let's just upgrade speed call all the way up. We're not really going to need stamina. Quick revive maybe for the like the health regen, but we really need pack three. Like this storm creaker is taking forever to kill. Maybe I should just save for pack three. Maybe that should be our plan. But I don't want to go back into Sheena without pack three. Okay. Oh, wait. How did I get that armor tier three? Oh, I literally just upgraded it. I have dementia. All right. I'm upgrading speed cola. We're going to throw a few dollar redos into this. And then I'm going to go run a different event. I'm going to go run Purge. Get the bonus cash from that. We'll run a few of those until I can get pack three and then head back into Shino. Because maybe I'll be able to get some... Uh some carnage metals that way because this is not doing it oh yeah i forgot for purge i just need to like stand on these things oh we only have a short amount of time too maybe quick this has got to be real tough at like a high ass round 13 is already kind of high for vanguard oh uh, i don't know where the other three are we only have 47 seconds okay here's another one come on where are the rest oh fuck i have 30 seconds to find the next two they better be over here okay found them Okay, last one. There we go. And I think if we just do one more of these side events, we should have enough for pack three. And we'll get a few more uh, hearts to upgrade our covenants, if there is the option to. What do we got? None of these are going to help us. What is this? I don't care. I'm just going to do it. All right, blitz. All I got to do is survive. Easy. We can do that. Let's see if I can get a, a, a 10 zombie pile up here. We might be able to now. Maybe it's time to get some carnage medals. All right, let's try it. Let's go. I just killed them all with a, a storm Krieger or storm shriek, whatever the hell these things are called. They're basically just what? What are those things called? Tormentors? That's all they are, except they're loud. This guy's fucking impossible to kill. Jeez, save some health for the rest of us, pal. Oh my God, there's another one. Why don't you fuck off? Please and thank you. Those are 1600 Pack-A-Punch eliminations. Dude, we have so much to do. Die. Thank you. And we're finally done. Dropped a few guns for us too. All right, Covenants, what do you got? Death Blow. Now that it's legendary, you might pick it up. Oh, legendary Brimstone. Let's grab that. Maybe that'll help with our Carnage medals. And we do have another heart. Should we get it over Dead Accurate? I don't think so, because Dead Accurate's the only one helping us get camos right now. We do have enough to get pack three, so let's grab that. And then we can kind of head just back into Shino and get everything done. So let's go ahead and do that. I'm just going to run past all these zombies. And we're back home. Another pack punch came out down the drain. Or down the drain. I mean, we just got it done. Oh, and we got a, a quick little calling card. Look at us go. There we go. Finally got a carnage medal. That's what I need. Massacre medal, actually. And now the zombie spawns have slowed down like crazy. Oh, because it's the end. Okay. It seems like once we pop our ring of fire, we can start getting these carnage medals. It seems like I get killed so much faster. We even got a massacre medal. We even got a bloodbath. We got it up to 20. Oh, shit. There's so many zombies. Oh, we got a camo, though. Don't know what that's for. We got two camos. We're still moving up in the world. Spring of fire time and double points time. There's just so much happening on the screen. I don't even know what's going on. Oh, yeah. We're racking up these carnage medals now. We got extermination. We got up to 25. That's ridiculous. I guess I'm just going to stay here. I'll, I'll, I'll head back on the next one on our next way out. Then we'll see what's up with uh, the covenants then. Then maybe we'll upgrade some perks too. We'll have enough to get everything fully up. This is kind of cracked. Just sit right here. Get kills. Unholy ground would be so nice for this. Come on, just let me kill this guy so I can run up there and get that full power. Perfect. Whole new ring of fire ready to go. Oh yeah, we're racking up carnage medals now. This should be easy. It's just our covenant kills that I'm a little afraid of not getting. All right, let's head back and check on our covenant. All right, show me what you got. Death blow. Don't want that. Melee attacks do more damage and heal you mm, don't really want any of those i guess i'll just upgrade my perks and then we'll come back and check on them again later Perk revives fully upgraded let's go ahead and upgrade stamina up even though we probably don't need it we'll do it just for fun all right uh one more drink of it and everything will be fully maxed out perfect all right back to shino 
These kills aren't going to get themselves. Actually, with Brimstone, they might. Actually, you think them calling it Brimstone is kind of a nod to Valorant? Because the character Brimstone is also voiced by one of the original four for zombies. I'm probably digging a little deep here on, on my game theory shit. But that would be a, a, a nice little nod to him. Can this thing just die? Holy shit. It's like almost on order level health. What? Somewhere down the line, I must have switched out my monkey bombs for a gas grenade. I had three monkey bombs, and now they're gone. Scammed. Oh, no. I'm going to go down. Oh, nuke. Thank God. Oh, I'm down. Not good. Guess I have to use my self-revive. Yeah, zombies, get out of here. Make like a tree and fuck off. We still got to keep on living, though. We got to survive. Not going to let us out of here that easy. Where's ammo, though? Where can I buy ammo? Just to make sure that I don't run out. There it is. Oh, my Lanta. They're hurting. They're hurting bad. Oh, shit. Come on. Let me down the stairs, please. Hurtled. Ring of fire. Go now. Use it. I'm hitting the button. It's not working. I went down, so now I can't use it. What the fuck? Oh, this is the game. Stim. No shot. If I die here, I'm not going for it again. I'll have to get it later. My ring of fire literally does not work. Stim again. And we're down. It's over. We died because our ring of fire just broke after we went down. Come on. No way I just played for an hour to lose to my ring of fire not working. That's stupid. And we got two butts on the screen. Come on. Damn. It takes so long to set up in this game and they just died of some nonsense. We only got a thousand kills during that too. How long does this thing take to get done? Oh my. We didn't even get our rapid kills. That's so stupid. All right. I'm going to take a break. And then we'll come back and I'll finish this thing. All right, it was actually probably a good thing that I died because immediately after I had to go take a dump. And as you guys know, can't pause in Vanguard. So probably would have ended up the same way. But anyways, uh, I'm going to go ahead, hop back in, try to grind all the rest of these camos. I'll show you if anything crazy happens, but I'm probably just going to skip until that I, I get the mastery camo. So I'll be right back. Oh, is that finally it? Thank fuck. All right, after another hour and a half, I finally got Gold Viper. I'm getting the hell out of here. Jeez. Okay, so overall, the zombie experience, you know, it's definitely under a lot of other zombies games. But the main thing I like to do in COD games is grind camos. And the camo grind in this game isn't really a grind. It, it, it's it's a drag. It takes so long to do. One, it takes very long to get set up in zombies. So if you die, that's like another half hour you got to spend getting everything you want back. And two, most of the time to get those carnage medals, you're just going to be meleeing instead of shooting. Because for whatever reason, that melee timing is just years and years better than just trying to shoot and get the 10 kills rapidly unless you're on like a high round. Like just going around, hitting the melees, you get carnage medals so much faster, so much easier, so much more efficiently. It's honestly just ridiculous how slow it takes to grind out camos. Like I already had camos ready for this gun. Like I already did a few camos for it as well as had this all the way max level before I joined in and it still took like two and a half hours to get it done. I died on two of the games, but like it still shouldn't take that long. Like I shouldn't have to play for a half hour to even start getting like certain challenges done, you know? I don't know. I feel like in, in the zombies tweaks, if they tweak the camos as well to be a little like, I don't know, less time consuming to get. I don't mind if they're like difficult. I just don't want it to be like a whole afternoon thing to get something done, which it seems like it is. Because in Cold War, if I have something fully leveled up, it takes me probably an hour, 15 minutes to get, a, get it every single camo for it. In this game, if I have all the camos for it and it's already leveled up, which takes like, I don't know, like two days on itself it still is gonna take me another three hours to get the camos done like it's ridiculous anyways let's go check out what the camo looks like all right let's take a look at what the stg looks like with gold viper on it this is of course with the mastercraft honestly that looks sick i like that a lot i'll check out plague diamond pretty cool the whole skull turns that rose gold which is nice i like to see a lot of that secondary color and then dark aether on it is kind of eh. i still don't really like this camo too much but the two camos before it are pretty nice but anyways, let's go ahead and hop in game with it. I'll show you guys the Mastercraft version as well as the normal. All right, this is what the STG looks like with the Mastercraft on it with Gold Viper. Very nice. Honestly, I really like how camo coverage looks in this game. It's going over the whole hand. That's grabbing the scope. It, I don't, They just really did camo coverage right, but kind of missed on some of the camos. But this thing with this looking real nice. Let's go ahead and see what the vanilla version of the STG looks like with Gold Viper. All right, this is the STG with Gold Viper. No Mastercraft on it. Honestly, it's really clean. The whole thing's covered. You see a whole lot of the texture of the camo. It's just looking nice. I, I really do like the camos in this game. I just wish it didn't take my whole afternoon to get them. But there you have it. We came back to Vanguard to get a weapon done. Uh, we'll probably come back, you know, every once in a while to get something done here. 
Uh, I don't know if I want to make this a regular thing just because of how long it takes. Like I probably could have gone to round, round 100 on uh, Cold War in the same amount of time. But uh, I do like grinding camos, even if it is like this boring and draining. But, you know, I just like the satisfaction of having something unlocked and getting to that mastery camo. So we will get eventually. Maybe it be a stream thing. Uh, I, I guess we'll see in the future. But uh, that's where I'm going to end today's video. So if you guys like this, you want to see more, go and leave a like on it. If you didn't and you don't dislike, if you're new here, please consider subscribe and put out all kinds of COD content throughout the week. That's going to be it for me today. I'll see you guys next time. Later.